right, before we get started, I feel the need to say sharks are not typically a dangerous species, especially these sharks. We love sharks. We love Jaws the movie. We can love yes, both. Baby. These are amazing creatures. Awesome. We caught a ton of them down there. <laughs> there are a lot there, but we tend to throw them all back. We kept one for this episode. They are delicious, but they are high in mercury. So as always, do your own research. And if you do uh, want to eat one, uh, maybe this video will kind of help you get prepared for it. We always have heard, you know, you should skin them and gut them immediately upon catching them uh, so they don't release any of the toxins and create negative flavors. But that just wasn't an option where we were fishing, so we also read that ice baths were good, so we put it into an ice bath immediately to camp. We skinned it and gut, or gutted it, um, left the skin on because it was just too tricky. It's such a small fish, so um, we stake cut it, as you can see right here. I had removed each fin <clears throat> prior to doing these steak cuts. Uh, and then once I got the steak cuts done, I then skinned each little steak, which sounds uh, hard, but it's kind of the natural lazy way that it progresses. Uh, it's the only way that I could do it with preserving all the meat. And you see that it, it it's pretty... Um, you know, you just let the, the, the knife do the work and uh, it'll go around the backbone and it'll, it'll come completely around the piece of meat. And you're left with like any steak cut of a fish you'd see in the grocery store. So for the marinade for the steak, it's gonna be real simple. We just added three spices, we had chives, rosemary, sage, two lemons, and then I'm gonna fill the rest up with a bag with liquid uh, from a Cape May IPA. And I always pick a different beer. This time I noticed that it pairs well with fish, it says. Yeah, right there. So I'm gonna try that. There we go. All right, we are gonna cook up the shark got some stuffed mushrooms we're gonna cook with it uh, stuffed artichoke spinach and cheese blend we've got our marinated shark Juices. If that dries out, I'm just going to add more juices while it's cooking. Probably let it go like five minutes and then we'll flip it and let it go another five. Just going to make sure it's done. It's been about five minutes. We're going to try to flip them around with this spatula. Added the liquid, the leftover liquid, which is the beer, and mix with the herbs. And I'm going to cover it with one of that. All right, we are ready. This looks delicious. All right, guys, we're going to test this shark out now. You might have to watch this. Look at that! Look at that! Mm. 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 Remember, there's a little bone in the middle of it. Mushroom. Sure. You can probably pull that bone right out of there. Mm -hmm. mm. So good. I really taste that lemon. Mm -hmm. You see it laughing. 
So we cooked the, <clears throat> we grilled the lemons skin side down and the juices are just flowing out of them. So good guys. So that's what the meat looks like. So this is the only bone or cartilage and you can pull it right out of there. But this is all meat. It's delicious. Well, thanks for joining us on another adventure. It's a dogfish shark. Delicious food. And um, this time, uh, we typically skin them right away because they do release this like bad taste. Uh, but this time, we just threw them right on ice water instead. And because we heard, as long if you put them on ice water, um, you know, it's just as good as skinning and gutting them. And yeah, I, there's absolutely zero negative taste to it at all. It's delicious. And we've spent, you know, close to $100 for Mako Shark down here before. It's every bit as good as that. So, all right. After this, we got to go fry up some flounder. So make sure you go find that fish video. And then we're going swimming. Yep. And we got some more adventures to go. So like and subscribe if you haven't already. If you already did, we appreciate you. And uh, we'll catch you on the water. Peace. Thank mm -hmm. you.